Well, I actually did my undergraduate study at BU as a mechanical engineering, and I learned a lot of like practical design and how do we design like hardwares, and it's really interesting. But as I move forward, I want to actually dig deeper into the theoretical parts because that's some of the stuff I'm actually missing. Uh, that is why I joined the, the systems engineering. I think there are many opportunities and many companies have already you know, started investing in this type of research. And I like hands-on stuff actually, although my current work is a lot of theoretical. So by the time I graduate, I want to actually work on real world problems and then work on the actual robots. Uh, a lot of the time people kind of uh, ignore the importance of the theoretical backgrounds. Um, when I first started, uh, all these papers, I, I think they are very difficult and I think they are not related to anything we do in real life. But I was wrong because as I move forward, I realized all these, uh, all these important pieces behind the machine learning or the, you know, the control tests uh, applied mathematics, right? So have a strong background in this area actually benefit you quite a lot. As in real world situation, you will have a sense of what type of uh, mathematical formulations you can use. Uh, so you have all these two sets in your box. You can apply it directly in the real world problems. I've talked to many different professors as when I was an undergrad student here. And uh, by the time I already know which professors were working on which projects. So it, it's kind of natural for me to directly uh, start my graduate studies here. So I would first suggest them to contact different professors and look into what type of research they are doing. And uh, trust me, because that at the beginning you think that something is really interesting, and by the time you start, it will change for many people. So I think at the beginning you have to just explore in different areas to be as open-minded as possible. Um, and the, what great about system engineering program is that we have a rotation program. So we will be, so once you enter as a PhD student, you can work with different professors for each semester. And then after one year, you decide which professor you will stay with.